the this one of the masterpieces masterpiece of the uh, TP, the uh, TPS Turbo Shooter game Max Payne. Yeah, it said a uh, bullet time. It can uh, your character can uh, sl slow down the time and shoot the enemy to death. Sound interesting, right? And the story they follow about a, a guy. This guy is uh, Detective Mark Payne. Uh, in this uh, game, this is uh, Max Payne 3. This is the chapter 3 of uh, his of his life. He uh, he, uh, he had a chance to this story. He was hunted by the death of the his wife and his daughter who were killed in the Max Payne 1. I had completed uh, all the three chapters of the hit line and I have to say all the games are the best and you can search on the Google, you can check the uh, rating of them on the Metacritic or uh, IGN and Gamespot. They were all of them were received received high quick high critical acclaim from both made from both the critic and the player. So let's play, shall we? Chapter one. Okay, checkpoint. Point one. Okay, so let's start. Education and a co-capital to a working hard work like 
I was mostly working for Rodrigo Bronco, a local businessman, built things, did some charity, had things named after him, won awards, owned things, people. One of the trophies he had won was his wife, Fabiana. She was hot and wanted to be dangerous. Some good genes trying to fight their way out of a cesspit. She'd married well, and it was now a leisure to regret her good fortune. They got along as well as any rich workaholic and a younger airhead wife tend to get along. They mostly ignored each other. She spent a lot of time with his cokehead younger brother, Marcello. He was a good time guy if your idea of a good time was an expensive suit, a bottle of champagne, and nothing between the ears. The middle brother, Victor, had just walked in. He was a local politician. The guy was smoother than an oil slick on an iceberg and about as toxic. The rest of the crowd, I didn't know, but I could imagine the types. People who know if they drink enough, they won't have to feel guilty about their good fortune. Suddenly, things turned real ugly. Felt like our hangovers arrived right on cue. Things had gone from fine to fucked up in about a second. And now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear! Got this morning? Sure. Look after yourself, bro. Stay safe. It wasn't my own safety I was concerned about. Trophy wife or not. I said I would protect the girl. It wasn't the time, and I was still a little rusty, but the tune was coming together. Just as this new start of mine was about to come to a shuddering halt. Before I knew it, I was back taking insane risks, trying to save fallen women.
my say so. I had to move. Goodbye, sucker. Taking him out through the basin. Maybe I still had a shot. Rodrigo was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I had to work hard to get him back, but any of the bad guys who want the boss alive almost as much as I did. I don't learn, I, I don't learn Brazilian. Back home, 
only it was time for some R and R. The only way I knew how. And with that, I guess I was ready for bed. This is the end of the show. Once, guys, hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks for watching.